Next, to Drago's, a Yugoslavian restaurant in Metairie, Louisiana, to meet Clara Satanovic, who runs the operation with her husband and son. The family is from Dubrovnik, a port city on the Adriatic, where their Christmas celebration always includes the staple, sarma, or stuffed cabbage. Clara begins by coring five heads of cabbage before they are boiled. Uh, I'm going to parboil it for approximately five minutes. I'm putting in my boiling water one cup of vinegar. Uh, this prevents cabbage from falling apart. Meanwhile, the filling starts by grinding two onions, a pound of bacon, and six to eight cloves of garlic. This mixture goes into a fairly hot, preheated pan. The bacon will provide the cooking grease. This has to brown quite nicely until onions is nice and brown. Aromatics, one bunch each of celery and parsley, are ground and will be added to the sautéed onions. The heads of cabbage are done and removed from the water to cool. Clara has seasoned with salt and added the aromatics to the onion mixture. Now, the meat. Two and a half pounds of beef. Two and a half pounds of pork. And two and a half pounds of eel. This dish is very good if it's made in large quantity because it's normally better second and third day. The meat is browned, then removed from the heat and cool before stuffing. Meanwhile, Clara trims the thick center rib from each cabbage leaf, which will facilitate rolling. Now, if it didn't get done through and through, you can dump it in the water again for a few minutes. Meat mixture with seasoning is now nice and cool, so I can get into it with my bare hands and mix it well with the rest of ingredients. First comes in two cups of raw rice. Here are the rest of the ingredients for the stuffing. The stuffing Remember, this recipe makes 40 mix to 50 really cabbage well. rolls. The cabbage rolls will be baked with a tomato mixture that includes the remaining chopped cabbage hearts and drained sauerkraut. Two large cans of tomato puree, about 56 ounces, are added along with salt and pepper to taste. Nice and tight. The cabbage rolls are alternated between layers of the sauerkraut cabbage mixture. Sauerkraut cabbage mixture. Perfect fit. Look at that, guys. A final layer of sauerkraut and cabbage precedes a large can of tomato juice. We're going to take our tomato juice. Fill it with tomato juice. Finally, about three tablespoons of sugar and eight whole cloves are sprinkled on top of the casserole before baking. In cover. Bring the mixture to a boil in a preheated 500 degree oven. Then lower the temperature to 350 degrees and bake about two and a half hours. Serve the stuffed cabbage with boiled potatoes. <laughs>